Okay, so here's really some nostalgia. These are from like 1978, it, six. Uh, the Kraft Elec Riders. I bid on these and uh, nobody else bid on them, so I ended up getting them. Anyway, I've got the one in a box. Got a new, oh, this back tire shot. I just noticed that. This back tire is good. Uh, I've got another nicer one in the box, so these will work out as parts and have a brand new, never been used frame. I had one of these as a kid. I remember running up and down the street. But uh, take a look at this Tower Hobbies 72.230. Look at the size of this receiver. That thing is just massive. And uh, so these bikes came originally with like a 380 size motor. Apparently somebody jammed a big block in this one and put a 540 in there. Look at that speed control up there too. And then you have this servo here operated the speed control. And the bike would steer. So the bike would steer by uh, counter steering. So you turn the turn the wheel one way and the bike would lean over and counter steer go to the right. Or counter steer go to the left. Boy, this one here is in pretty rough shape. Oh, wow. Still works. Shocks are broken on this one. Wait till you see the rider. He's been through hell. These old guys done blown out his knees. Got a limp arm. Here's his arm piece right here. Oh, still got the elf sticker on back of his suit. Tore his arm completely off. And then this one's floppy floppy. At least his legs are still good. So, yeah, they didn't didn't come with much of a fairing either. Unless they have another new fairing. Maybe we'll probably make fiberglass mold off the, the new one I have. And I have one good front fairing. Maybe we'll try to make molds off of that too. But uh, just some old school motorcycles. Pre Losi, pre gyro in them to keep them stabilized. You had to actually keep these things going uh, at a fairly good clip to keep them up, and you had to had to not be able to run into curbs and everything else to keep them going. And still, you've got the Goodyear sticker on the tires. That one does Goodyear on the back. Oh, it's got a Goodyear sticker on the front. It's a nice little chain drive here. Still got good gears in there too. That's those are the hard ones to find right there. The gears. I have a set, extra set. So we'll look at the size of pinion on that one. Holy cow! Compared to the one on the 380 little motor, I still can't get over. Yeah, that's how big the fucking receivers were back in the day. Huge. You put your Small nickel and NICAD pack. There's a real small NICAD pack that went underneath. Helps keep your weight low. I don't remember if you maybe you zip ties to hold them in place and Velcro. But that is some serious craft uh, Elec Rider history here. I'll show you the other one. We got the other one in the box. It's up there. Yeah, it was in much better shape than those two. So. Yeah, not boat related, but just some RC nostalgia. Thanks for watching.